welcome to the Goshen High School March Newsletter. We have some exciting events going on this month, ending with, at the end of this month, we have no school, because we will be on spring break. Starting off with the first uh, day of March, March 1st, we're going to have our National Honor S Society inductee ceremony, which will be in the evening. It'll be at 6 o'clock here at Goshen High School. We hope everyone can be here to help celebrate the accomplishments of our NHS students. Another important event going on for Goshen High School athletes is that March 2nd we will have our league banquet. That will be over at Hammersville Middle School Gymnasium. That uh, banquet will start at 6 o'clock and that will be for our athletes who uh, achieve the first team all-star status in their respective sports. Hope to see you there. Another organization that people can volunteer their time here at Goshen High School would be our Athletic Boosters. And the next Athletic Boosters meeting will be March 15th at 7 o'clock p.m. here at Goshen High School. Always needing volunteers to help out in concessions and ticket sales. Anything else that you can help out with, we're always in need of, of extra help. So if you can do it, I'd like to see you then. Often people ask me, how can they get involved with Goshen High School's activities? How can they volunteer their time to help our kids in our community? One of the organizations that we have here at Goshen High School is called our PTO, our Parent Teacher Organization, and they meet once a month, and the next meeting will be March 7th at uh, 6.30 p.m. at the Middle School Library. So if you're interested in helping out with Goshen Schools and volunteering your time, that's one great organization that you can join. Folks, starting March 25th, there will be no school for Goshen High School students. We will be on spring break, and that will go into April 1st. And so we will go from March 25th to April 1st. There will be no school, and we will start school the following Monday for students and teachers. So enjoy your spring break, and look forward to seeing everybody when you come back. This past Thursday, we put on a political awareness night in our community room. We did this for our Look to Claremont College class. Our goal was to inform constituents of pressing political issues. And we hope to continue this project as it grows closer to the 2016 presidential election.